Any offline business wanting to promote itself online ought to have a listing in the Google Local Business Directory. To do this, you go to the Google homepage, as you see before you, and click on Maps, which is in the top left here. Default Maps page comes up, and you can see here the option to put your business on Google Maps. And you're prompted with a sign-in screen. You have to be signed into Google to list yourself on Google Maps. As you can see, it has populated the sign-in with my details because I have a Google account. If you do not have a Google account, you must select this option. Sign up for a free Google account and you can use your existing email address. You do not need to use a Gmail address. And then you'll be taken to the next screen, which we will see after I sign in. So here we have the dashboard. I have already listed a number of businesses, so you'll see them in my screen here as I scroll down. And you can also see I get reports on the number of views of each of those local business listings and the click-through ratio here. What you want to do is select Add Another Business or Add My Business, and you're presented with a simple form that you must complete. As you see, when you put in the street address, the map on the right here changes and they drop a pin on the address that they have. You must put in a phone number and I recommend you put in a number that is manned all the time. The reason to be in Google Maps is to have people call you. Email address is optional. You can see as I type the bubble in the map is updated. Describe your business. Now selecting categories. This one is a little bit odd because all the categories here are of course US style categories. Some of them don't match up to what takes place in other countries and some have different descriptions in other countries. You want to select up to five categories and make them as accurate as possible. When you type you will see suggestions made to you. You can add a custom category after you have selected all your categories. I'll leave it at two and they will do a search to see if there's any similar business listed either at your address or with a similar name. If none of the suggested businesses are yours, you click on Add Listing. However, you may find that your business is already listed, especially if you have taken advertising with True Local, Yellow Pages, one of those directory services, and they may submit a listing on your behalf. I recommend you claim your listing because I can almost guarantee that listing will be inaccurate or incomplete. Click on Add Listing, and they'll ask you to fill in a few more details. I'm going to leave them as a default today, but you can see you can choose different options. I'm just going to leave payment options as cash only. You can add a photo. If you don't add a photo, the photo that people will see when they see your Google listing will most likely be a street view from near your business. And you can even add videos from YouTube. Additional details. They have some suggestions here on what to do. You can add those additional details if it's appropriate. One small option here is fix incorrect marker location. What you find is sometimes Google's idea of where that street address is situated is not accurate. You may need to manipulate the pin marker on the map to make sure it is right on your business. After you've done all of that, click on Submit. And then you see the screen asking you to verify your business. Now there are three ways to verify your business and the one I recommend is by phone. It's immediate. If you have a mobile you can also do it by SMS, also immediate. But if you have no phone or the phone is not manned, you can ask them to send you a postcard and it may take a few weeks to come through. Once you've selected your verification method, click on finish and Google will verify your business. If you have selected phone or SMS, your phone will ring almost immediately. I'll click on finish and you have then this message. Once they have phoned you, you've written down the PIN, enter it in this box, click on go, and your business listing is verified and you are free to edit it, change it later if you need to. However, if you want to change the street address or phone number, you will need to re-verify it with Google. And that's how to add your business to Google Maps.